Hey guys, it's Hart, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a doll clipboard. And I'll show you what you need. But first, I'll show you what it looks like. Um, it's going to look like this. This is the one I used in mu the Music Hidden Beneath Me episode 3. Sorry, the handwriting is messy, but um, that's what it's going to turn out like. So the first thing you'll need are scissors. Any kind, big or small, doesn't matter. Um, markers are optional if you want to write anything. If you're going to put paper on the front of your clipboard, they're optional, though. Um, you're going to need index cards. Uh, four is good. if you're, You need four if you're going to put a uh, paper on the front. So um, if you're not going to put anything on the front, you just need three. And you're going to need brown construction paper. Not, not a lot at all. Um, I only used, like, this much, probably. And then um, glue. You can use a glue stick. Tape also works, but you don't have it either one. I recommend glue better, though. Sorry, my hands are messy. I did a lot of stuff. Markers today. <clears throat> and you're also going to need a teeny bit of yarn, um, about that much. So first off, you're going to want to take three index cards. You can't, it, do, it doesn't, oh, I forgot to tell you, you need also a used up pencil. It do, you can have um, as many as you want in there. It's just going to affect the thickness of your clipboard. Um, so I'm actually going to use four. And I'll get another index card after. But, um, you're going to want to take your index cards and um, just put them together. You don't have to glue them together. You just need to take them. Um, then you're going to want your construction paper and glue. So now you just have to measure um, how much construction paper you need. Um, so... You just need to like about like that and um, put it on the edge so you don't have to cut off too much and just mark where you need to cut off and then you want it to fold over your index card, so you want to um, fold it like that. Make another mark um, here. So, you see that. Um, and then you're just going to want to cut, take your index cards out and cut down. And cut here, and then, okay. So it might be a little bit messy, that's okay. <clears throat> You're just going to want to take your glue and put some on your index cards or the inside of your, um, brown construction paper either way doesn't matter and stick it in there like, like this and then you're just going to want to glue the top of your index cards And fold it shut. And then um, you can just perfect it, like you can cut off some the excess. So just make sure you can't see any white.
and here you go. And um, then you're going to get your another index card if you're going to put a paper on it. And you can just flip it this way. You can trim it down a little bit so it shows some of the clipboard. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, so um, I'm just, I'll show you this and I'll show you the next step. Okay, so just make something simple like this to um, do it. It doesn't have to be fancy at all. I only made this spot smaller in this because it was like a whole school sign up list, but this is just for my sister. So um, you're going to put it on the clipboard or the brown thing right now. And then um, take a small, what are these called? What are these called? What? what it, binder clip, a small binder clip. And just clip the paper to the clipboard. Like this. Now, um, you don't need to add a pencil to it, but if you want to, I'll show you how. Take a little bit of yarn and just cut it. And then um, take your pencil or pen, little pen, or pencil, and then just double knot it on this. Okay, so now you just have the pencil on the string. Then you're going to slip the string into the loop on the binder clip and you're just going to double knot it. It doesn't matter, well, you don't have to double knot it, but I just added one knot for now. And you have your sign up list. You can like actually write, but I recommend using a marker instead, so if you were making this for a video, it would show up better. Um, so I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope this helps. So, um, See, the pencil will slip out sometimes, mine just did on here. But you can just easily slip it back, right back in. And don't just um, sharpen a new pencil all the way down. Just find one that's already, like, broken or used a lot so you can just use recycled material so that's how to make a doll clipboard and i hope you enjoyed i hope this helps bye